guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you guys how i achieved this top knot bun with rubber band style if you want to see how i did it keep watching you're gonna need a hard and soft bristle brush you're gonna need a detangling comb a comb to part your hair a edge brush some scrunchies and some rubber bands you're gonna need some bobby pins you're gonna need a spray bottle some edge booster and you're also going to need some eco styler and you're gonna need a scarf to wrap your hair at the end so since i already detangled my hair off camera i'm now just gonna go into parting my hair and what i'm doing right now is just parting my hair down the middle and i'm going to part it off into two sections So now that I've got my hair braided off into those two sections, I'm just going to take some eco styler to brush away the hair that I'm not going to be using just so it doesn't get mixed up with the hair that I am using.
part this section into two separate sections because this is where you're actually going to start putting the rubber bands on the hair. It is helpful to kind of clip your hair out of the way and I'm also going to put some edge booster on my edges just to slick the front of my hair down and I'm going to start putting the rubber bands on. I do want you to keep in mind that when you're putting the rubber bands on, don't twist it around too many times because if it's too tight, you're going to have to take it out and redo it and it's going to be pulling your edges and pulling your hair and you don't want that. I'm now doing the same exact thing on this side as I did on the other side I will say that the parting is the hardest part of this whole thing because you have to make sure your parts are really straight and it can take a while but I'm just gonna do the same exact thing I did on the other side on this side
now that you have your four sections, you're going to start twisting the hair in a crisscross direction. And when you get to the end of twisting your hair and you've met the other rubber band, you're going to take another rubber band and you're just going to secure those two sections together. So once you finish twisting the four sections in crisscross directions, you're going to go ahead and start slicking down the rest of your hair starting in the back. And what I'm going to use first is Eco Styler and then I'm going to go in with Edge Booster and I'm going to be using a hard and soft bristle brush to do these steps. So now that I've finished pulling my hair out in the puff, I'm going to go ahead and start forming my bun. So now I'm just taking a little edge booster to actually slick my edges down and I'm also going to use the edge booster to hit up any spots that I missed when I was originally slicking my hair down.
So now I'm taking my silk scarf to actually lay my hair down. You want to at least leave your silk scarf on for at least 30 minutes so that your hair can properly dry and mold. But I usually leave mine on overnight. So this is the next morning. I'm taking off my scarf and this is how my hair turned out. That is going to wrap up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and found it helpful. Don't forget to follow me on all my social medias linked in the description box below. And also stay tuned for the huge natural hair giveaway that I'll be doing soon. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.